In other news now, worried by the spate of human trafficking, child abuse and other related crimes in the country, a group under the ages of Rule of Law and Accountability Center, Rule Access, there is a need for proactive actions rising from a stakeholder's engagement on human trafficking and child abuse in Nigeria, led by the police and the National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, NAPTIC. Rule Access calls on the federal government to seek an end to poverty and solve the biting unemployment issue. Executive Director Rulak Okechukunwangoma says the engagement seeks to find out how law enforcement agencies have responded to these human rights issues. One of the issues that came up repeatedly here is that the adoption process is quite tough and quite uh, rigorous, and that government should make it easier so that people can uh, actually, people who want to adopt, can adopt so that they don't have, have to find reasons to engage. In trafficking, in, in, in the name of uh, trying to adopt you know, children illegally. According to the NAPTIP representative, Comfort Sunny, she said girls and women are the main victims of trafficking. She explains that some of the challenges they have is that they do not have much evidence as to prosecute some of their outstanding cases. Other speakers at the event called for more sensitization from the NAPTIP and other agencies to discourage people from embarking on illegal migration. Some of these girls will lie to you that, yes, I have a I look younger than my age and older than 18 because they have been told what to tell us. So we are still working. It's work in progress. Most times we do better with people in rural community because some of these girls are not even enlightened. They don't know what they are doing. But you find that some young persons on their own will look for recruiters. Put me through the waste. People in the villages who are not aware of women are sending their children to the or some of them can be used to things that can kill them. And like you heard one man say, they may never even see them again. A talking health now, the Kedula State Government has confirmed that.